And there's many, many types of leadership. You know, for example, um, David Blackwell, who is the most distinguished African American mathematician this country's ever produced. Okay, he died in 2010, but no doubt the most distinguished African American mathematician. So when I gave my talk at Berkeley, I gave a talk at Berkeley. Okay, and I gave a lot of talks. Okay? But at Berkeley, I decided that the title of my talk would be why Berkeley Math would never hire me, okay? <laughs> okay? And I did. I gave why Berkeley Math would never hire me. And the who's who of Berkeley were in the front row, everybody. You know, the presidents and Carl Pister and everybody. And so I started this big discussion back and forth. And people say, no, we would. No, we wouldn't. Yeah, we would. Okay, we wouldn't. So anyway, but, but here's what happened. Okay, so after the talk, David Blackwell was there. And David Blackwell went to Berkeley in 1955 and he was turned down in 1942. But he came to me real quietly, and he said, Richard, I wish I could have said the things that you said today, but it wouldn't have been effective in my day. I couldn't have done it. So I really thank you for what you said. And I said, David, don't ever apologize for not giving the leadership that you want to, because you gave us the most beautiful thing of all time. You showed us that excellence comes in many colors. You showed us that excellence comes in all colors, okay? So that was leadership. So David did just research, but it was leadership. Now, some other people don't do the research, but they give other programs. So we need all kinds of leaders. But I do believe that you see success when the students react to what you're doing. Now, and I said to you earlier that I'm kind of...